bro. This is some real. That's some '90s love right there. Like, when was this picture taken? <laughs> a couple months ago. <laughs> a couple of months ago? You telling me this is not a, a an in sync cover <laughs> album with, with Justin and JC? This is friends party in hell. <laughs> that fool said, "I'm above average." I mean, I ain't no Ron Jeremy or nothing. <laughs> hey, stay with me, man. Stay with me. Okay. You can stop right there. That's hard. You hear that, Netflix? You hear that? Also, give us a shout. I have no idea what I'm talking about most of the time. <laughs> the only podcast approved by the Vatican. That's the American <laughs> spirit right there. <laughs> you weren't expecting that, were you? Another Congress guy. Another one of their party. It's uh, this yeah. this guy with the really with the most waspiest name you could possibly have, Madison <laughs> Hawthorne. <laughs> Cawthorn oh, uh, with a C. It's a Cawthorn. It's I thought it was Hawthorne. Haw- I thought it was. Oh, it is Cawthorn. Oh my it's god. Cawthorn. Madison yeah. Cawthorn from of the Cawthorns <laughs> in Connecticut. Of the, of the Connecticut Cawthorns. <laughs> This fucking fruit bat. God damn it. He people, sucks, man. man. So, God, okay. Yeah. So, real quick and you kind of correct me if I'm if I'm wrong about this, but this dude same same kind of uh toes the party line. Really, yeah. he went to he, this motherfucker went to Germany to visit um like locations where Hitler lived and like it's like a Hitler tour that he went he went on, all right? This dude, all right? Why you would do that, like, you know, fine, maybe you're a history buff, but the problem <laughs> is that the other shit you do doesn't back up that you're, like, a history buff, right? Because yeah. you're, you're a misogynistic, racist dude who says some outlandish shit, just like everyone else. But the reason why this dude doesn't get shit is because he's disabled. He's in a wheelchair. Oh, he's in a wheelchair. Okay. So there's this weird sympathy. It's like, oh, I mean, he's, like... I mean, he could be like a little racist. He's disabled. I mean, come on. Like, what are we gonna do? Like, like pile on this guy? His life's already hard. Like, no, dude. Like, fuck no, your legs. On. Like, you, yeah. you, like, <laughs> like you, you don't get, you don't like get some any sympathy shit just because you nope. fucking. And he lied pile about. It. And he lied about pile how he got. All in this life. Yeah, he got. He lied about how he got disabled too. He said he got disabled. I think with like some some military shit, and, but he never went into the oh, military. Like there's damn, really yeah. how he he got it. He got disabled sucking. I don't. I don't even know. Long. I don't know. There's some. There's some. He's mm-hmm. some shade. He's a he shady ass dude. He's probably yeah, probably doing that. But anyway, the point is that he got in trouble lately because I don't know. I don't know what where the rift happened, but he started mm-hmm. talking shit about his own party, which in the Republican Party is a very big no no. Which no, no. Yeah. in the Democratic Party, that's why the Democrats don't get shit done most of the time because there's so much like they don't they don't toe the party line. They everyone kind of does no. whatever they want, which I mean that's what a democracy is, but to get shit passed in this kind of system that we live in, it doesn't work because even it's even right. Republicans that don't agree to shit like have to have to or the whole machine will like come crashing on them. Yeah. So you gotta you gotta you gotta follow orders or whatever. So this dude stopped doing that. And one of the things that he did was he went on a podcast and started talking about how he gets invited to orgies where by con- of congressmen invite him to orgies where they do Ooh, coke. Right? His colleagues. Yeah, his colleagues. <laughs> and so let's just say you and I, you know, we're work buddies, right? And then you go on a podcast and you say, Yeah, man, Rudy invites me to orgies all the time and does coke lines off off hookers. But yeah. you know, I'm not I'm not, you know, I don't I don't partake in that kind of stuff. I'd be a little miffed that you would like put out my business like that number one if it's true right and number two of course regardless right it's be like hey why yeah. why are you why are you talking like what's the matter no, with it if, if i didn't tell anybody <laughs> why are you telling people yeah <laughs> yeah so that got him into some hot water so mm-hmm. because of that and then he did something else i can't remember he did I know he. I know. Was that him? That the picture of him in the lingerie at the orgy. Well, okay. and then... right, 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 right. So I'll get to that. I'll get to that. But he did. Okay. He did. Okay. He did something else. I forget what he did. He said something. He said something. Another. He did something else along those lines of like saying shit he shouldn't be saying about his own party. But then, all of a sudden, because he's in hot water, well, what's the best way to you know get someone off the team? You're gonna you're gonna burn them. So the party, yeah. it seems, it seems that the party yeah. had some dirt on him, and then they just released it, and they're like, "All right, well, since you want to throw us under the bus, 
Now we're going to throw you. Like, this is all. See, also, politics can be really fun, guys, if you guys pay attention, because there's a lot it of there's be. a lot of shit like this. <laughs> sorted. It's, yeah, there's some sorted <laughs> shit that happens, too, just like this, because all of a sudden he's in a bad he's in a bad place with the party. And then yeah. all of a sudden shit just comes out on him that he obviously that is not putting out. So no someone. So there's money behind this kind of smear campaign to ruin his career. Obviously, they're trying to, yeah, and because they're they're trying to, they're leaning into the he because he's gay, right? Right, Be, but he's also like super, he's super anti gay too. You know what I mean? That's what I was saying. Right. He's an anti gay politician yeah. who's actually gay. Yeah, who's actually gay, right? Okay. So they're trying to out him. So yeah. here's a here's a um here's this post, <clears throat> and it's a tweet actually, and it's mm-hmm. update. Uh, this is by Mike Sington. Many people in this thread are saying, of course, Madison Cawthorn has a live in aid. He's in a wheelchair. <laughs> to clarify, Stephen Smith is an employee of the house. His salary paid by taxpayers to work as a staffer for Cawthorn. Another photo of them together. <laughs> this is someone Beautiful. that works for. <laughs> Beautiful. And you know what? Okay, so <laughs> the great. Okay, so this dude has this dude so has gay. a mistress. He has a mistress that's being it's a tax a taxpayer funded mistress. And it's like okay, wait, wait, wait. So wait, first off, first off, first off, what's the male equivalent? What's the male equivalent of a mistress? Because a mistress, <laughs> a mistress, a mattress, a mattress, right, <laughs> right? Because obviously, because the first name Matt, and then you rest on them. You, a mat, a mattress. <laughs> you lay on that shit. Lay on that mat. <laughs> Oh man, and it's it's just it's crazy because this kind of feels so good because he's like he's such a piece of shit too, and it's like they get their come up, but it's like their party eats itself alive too. That's like the yeah. other kind of crazy yeah. thing that yeah. they're so toxic there. The snake eating its tail. Yeah, yeah. So this is this like it's Boy, such, a, rom- picture, it's such a romantic picture. That picture is so romantic, bro. This is some real. It's some '90s love right there. Like, when was this picture taken? <laughs> a couple months ago. <laughs> a couple of months ago. You telling me this is not a, a an in sync cover <laughs> album with, with Justin and JC? <laughs> Jesus, dude. Uh, there's um. That is love. There's um um. Hang on. So so okay. So then this dropped right. And I pulled this up on the on like I put that on the list to kind of play um, to to talk about it and stuff like that. But then this fucking thing dropped today. No, yesterday. And there's a sex tape out. I haven't okay. seen it. I haven't seen it. But there is a video. There's a, a Reddit thread, actually, that talks that they're talking about. <laughs> it. And so anyway, so this is one of the like the images from the video. So um, they're saying that that um that he was humping is a friend he said he's humping a friend naked okay so that was his excuse like it wasn't me fucking some guy i'm just humping my friend naked that's I'm what just it's... humping a friend naked yeah what's the, what's that mean what kind of <laughs> double speak is that you were you're having sex with your friend <laughs> naked right like, 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 like the 32nd shared on twitter on wednesday shows a naked cawthorn appearing to hump and thrust on a bed near another man the video does not right. show any sexual activity between the two men. It appears the footage is being recorded by someone else in the room. Catherine Ca- can be heard moaning and yelling. Oh, okay. <laughs> so not only were they see, and this this thing this doesn't matter, right? Like in all honesty, it only the only reason we're talking about it is because he's an anti-gay hypocrite, <laughs> right, right? Right. But if this was a normal, if he was like for gay rights and he was trying to take down the establishment from the inside and trying to sway his party yeah. to give gay people equal rights because there are gay conservative men out there that could use his fucking representation right. there are they're out there so if he was doing that then this would this would be a non-starter but because he's trying to strip the rights away from gay men and women and the q's and pluses and uh, that sounds really bad the way it came out but well, i'm kind of here right now we get what you're saying we get what you're saying yeah. Like, yeah, the point is, we wouldn't be watching this dude bang his friend in a bed and laughing about it. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's it. Yes, yes. We're not gay shaming him. We're no. gay hypocrite shaming him. Exactly. He, who he has sex with does not matter to me. But when he starts telling other people who to have sex with right. and crossing a whole group of people off the list, only to then be found out he was fucking those same people. <laughs> That's as kinky as it gets. <laughs> but, ha ha Nelson that fool man nah bro yeah yeah